It's no secret that Emma Chamberlain is taking over the fashion industry. I mean, let's just put it this way. Emma Chamberlain wore a shoestring as a belt, so we all wore shoestrings as a belt. What is up, you guys? It's Erin Robinson here with Clever News, and if you're anything like us, you've taken some fashion inspo from our favorite former Visco girl, Emma Chamberlain. Keynote. I was a literal visco girl when I was like like two years ago or whatever like I was a visco girl from the looks of it Emma may be considered an e-girl now see for yourself I used to be a visco girl and now I'm an e-girl like wait am I an e-girl now but Emma's style is always evolving and we're totally here for it so much so that our girl has been landing brand deals left and right. Lucky for us because Black Friday is right around the corner and I swore I wouldn't wait last minute to do my holiday shopping this year. So alas, I shall not. So let's start with the obvious Emma approved brand to shop this holiday season. Emma practically broke the internet when she dropped her exclusive sunglasses collection with crap eyewear this year. This luxury eyewear brand is designed and tested beachside in LA by a group of surfers, skaters, musicians, and artists. Emma's collection features six limited edition pairs of sunglasses that are all so trendy and all undersized, obviously. But if you're anything like Emma, all of your holiday shopping can be done in just one quick trip to Target. Hey guys, it's Emma Chamberlain. I am at Target and I'm about to meet with a Target specialist, okay? It's no secret that Emma is a huge Target fan and they clearly love her right back. I mean, I don't see anybody else getting a full wardrobe makeover from a celebrity stylist at Target. I feel like so fashionable in this. And we this got you so... into a thigh high. I know, who would have thunk it? I, I actually really like it. Target is great and all, but if you have a little extra money to spend this holiday season, you can be like Emma and head over to the Louis Vuitton store. Or you can just get flown out by the brand itself and sit front row at the Paris Fashion Show. Hey guys, it's Emma Chamberlain. I am here for the Louis Vuitton show in Paris. I'm very excited. Or start a Louis Vuitton commercial. Ah, oh, a girl can dream, can't she? Meanwhile, I'll just be here saving it for that Louis Vuitton keychain I've been dreaming about for the past decade. But even with Emma's front row designer fashion show invites and commercials, she still manages to stay true to herself as the quirky, fun, teen queen that she is. Okay. Okay. See what I mean? She's always gonna be the Emma we've grown to love and adore, even with a Calvin Klein brand deal. Emma made us all want to run out and buy a matching set of Calvin Klein underwear pronto, seeing her Instagram post, they looked amazing. I mean, come on, she makes everything look so effortless. It's not even fair. Excuse me while I go camp out at Calvin Klein for Black Friday. Things might get messy. And while Calvin Klein has been around forever, Emma is known for creating her own personal style, and that includes bringing back trends that some of us may have actually completely forgotten about. I have this Von Dutch bag, which is what Paris Hilton used to wear. Although Emma initially incorporated Von Dutch into her wardrobe for a Halloween costume try-on video in which she dressed up as Paris Hilton, it looks like the brand is here to stay in her actual wardrobe. Check out this Von Dutch shirt she wore on the gram. Or this Von Dutch hat that she rocked also for the gram. And Speaking of accessories, what is a good outfit without a killer phone case? Am I right? Emma's personal favorite seems to be wildflower cases, which she's featured on her Instagram multiple times. Of course, in true Emma fashion, the phone case she features on Instagram is actually from her own personal collaboration with them. It's nice to see that she actually uses the products that she endorses. Another reason to love her, of course, we can not keep up with all the Emma approved brands, but I wanna know what you guys think. Which of these brands would you see yourself shopping at? And which brands do you think she'll collaborate with next? Let me know what you think down in the comments below. And after that, be sure to hit that subscribe button and click the bell so that you don't miss any of our news stories. Then also, you gotta click right here for more entertainment news, you guys. Thanks for hanging out with me here at Clever. I'm Erin Robinson. Have an awesome day.